Slope style. What a sport, hey? Oh, come on! Yes! <laughs> it's a work of art. It's always moving, flowing. Each one of these riders riding with their own unique pizzazz and style. Let me tell you, it's sexy. Joyride, you've heard of it, right? Of course you have, who hasn't? It's been 10 years of this iconic event. We've added some new features to the course. It's gonna be insane. Got the boys on the lip looking fresh. This might look like your basic hip, but to keep things exciting out here, we've decided to add two options to this feature, one to the left, one to the right. The riders get to pick where they want to ride and pick their poison. The lip is three hockey nets high, or for our non-Canadian friends, 12 feet tall. And the gap to each landing is 24 feet, which is the same as putting 58 cans of maple syrup side by side. It looks absolutely insane. All right, here we are at the coveted sphere. The outside diameter of this brand new feature is about 16 feet. Let me correct you, Griff. It's actually about 16.7 feet. Airing into the dish is roughly eight to 10 feet, depending on where you enter. The dish stands four and a half feet off the ground. You can fill the dish up with exactly 147,687 donut holes. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. This is one of the most iconic features on course. This feature is a massive log at 21 feet long and a 20 foot gap, which is the equivalent of stacking three branded Seminux on top of each other. I don't care who you are, you've got to love the atmosphere here at Joyride, but nothing will beat the feeling of landing that last trick for a full pull. One last feature to put an exclamation point on it. Oh! <laughs> yeah!